Tonight, a three-year-old girl and an eight-year-old boy still in the hospital following a shooting at a home on Detroit's west side. Coco McAvoy joins us live this evening with an update on how the kids are doing and the person police believe pulled the trigger. Coco. Yes, we just got an update from the Detroit Police Department, and we know a 24-year-old man is in police custody for the shooting. We also know the prosecutor's office is reviewing a warrant request in his case, and the woman, the man, and the two children who were all injured in the shooting are still in critical condition. Prison's not good enough for him. A man is in police custody after a vicious attack on a Detroit family that shocked the entire community yesterday. You have no remorse, no remorse at all. Police say a mother, her eight-year-old son, and another man were all shot in an ambush attack on McKenzie Street. The woman's three-year-old daughter was hit so hard by the suspect, her baby teeth came out. All of the victims are still in critical condition tonight as police pursue charges against the suspect. The person who flagged down help for the family was the woman's 11-year-old son. Maybe if he was older, he would have tried to protect them, but at that age, what can you do? He somehow got away and ran to a nearby tire store begging for help. It's still sad to be scared like that and have to leave and run and leave your mother and your sisters behind. Now, the prosecutor's office is looking at all of the evidence in this case before deciding what charges the suspect will face. And the suspect could be formally charged as early as tomorrow. Reporting live this evening, I'm Coco McAvoy, Local 4. All right, thank you, Coco.